Hey guys, so something that I really enjoy doing is a bit of a handbag reset. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys enjoy doing this as well, but often over the weekend I use a different handbag to what I do during the week when I go to work. And it's something that, yeah, I love going from my small bag and just being like, okay, let's reset for the week and just get my work bag all prepped and ready um, and organized. So I thought I would show you guys how I do it because right now I am using my weekend bag and a new week is about to start so I may as well do it with you guys now. And the other reason I wanted to show you guys this is because what I keep in my bag for work and what I keep in my bag for the weekends are completely different. So I thought it'd be a good chance to do a little bit of a what's in my bag um, when it comes to the weekend because I don't think I've done that before um, because I only really keep the essentials. So. At the moment, this weekend, I am using my Gucci Soho Disco Bag. It is my go-to for the weekends because it fits everything that I need. Um, especially now, since I've gone from a card holder to a wallet, I need to be using this bag because it fits my wallet really well. Um, some of my other bags just don't um, fit a full wallet. So anyway, this is what I'm using. And in here, I have everything that I would use on a weekend. So I thought I would just show you what's in here. So we've got my little reusable bag. I've got a couple of these. I rave about them, I love them, and I generally carry one in my weekend bag as well as my work bag, so I'll take that out. The other thing I have in here is my sunglasses. So at the moment I am wearing my Prada sunglasses. Now they are in this bag without a case right now. Um, which hurts my heart, but I just haven't found one um, that's small enough that can fit in this bag. But I'm going to have to get like a little cotton one or something like that that I can use. The other thing I have are my keys. Obviously, I take my keys everywhere, so they're in my bag for now. I then have a lip gloss and a perfume. Um, yeah, these I take everywhere. You can't go wrong with a lip balm and a perfume. Um, this one here is just a Zara one. It's beautiful. It smells amazing. It's called Lightly Bloom. So if you're someone who really wants to get a Zara perfume and you're not sure which one to get, um, but you're not near a Zara, jump online because they have all the perfumes on there. And I can assure you Lightly Bloom smells really, really nice. So definitely get yourself one of those. So I've got those in there and then I've just got my phone and then also my Louis Vuitton Epi Leather Wallet. I've been using this. I've been loving it. It is really nice to be able to keep all your coins. And the main thing for me is receipts. Um, I like to hold on to, I've said this before, but whenever I post items um, that I've sold on Depop, I hold on to the tracking receipt until the person have received the item. So sometimes I have a number of receipts that I need to hold on to. Um, so I've been keeping them in here and it's really, really handy. So that's everything that is in here and now this is empty all ready to go for next weekend um but now i'm going to pack my work bag i'm sure you guys have seen this before but the reason i wanted to call it a handbag reset is because by the end of the work week my bag can just fill up with stuff like bits of paper spare pens um i've got like i used my speedy last week here so that's why it's got stuff in here, but I've just got plastic bag. I've got pens. I've got these. I bought a bunch of stickers. My sister's a teacher. Um, and I came across a bunch of, I know scratch and sniffs were just such a thing when you're a kid. And I came across these. So I bought her a 16 each pack. Um, and it's just like watermelon, orange, strawberry, and apple. So I bought my sister those. I'm going to have to give them to her, but you know, just stuff like that. My work bag has been filling up with, um, that, doesn't need to be in there. So what I did just before is tip everything out of my work bag, put stuff in the bin, put stuff where it needs to be. And this week I'm going back to my Noe bag um, because I absolutely love it. And there's nothing inside right now. So that's completely empty and ready to go. And I pulled this organizer out of my Speedy. So the organizer is here. It's just one from Katie Australia. Um, and in here, I've just got some little bits left over from what I wanted to keep in here. In here is my work swipe card. And then I've got my Louis Vuitton pochette, which I've been using lately as a bit of a keep all in there. And in here, see, these are all the little bits, like I wouldn't carry them over the weekend, but I've got like a nail file. Um, I've got hand cream, the Lano Lips hand cream. I've got a pen. 
I've got hand sanitizer, I've got a phone cord, and then I've also got a bunch of band-aids. Another thing that I keep in my work bag and not my weekend bag is AirPods. Um, I don't carry them around on the weekend with me because I don't generally use them. Um, this is usually during the week when I'm going to gym and when I am at work, I like to listen to podcasts and stuff. So that goes in there. And then from here, I'll just put my lip balm in there. So that's everything ready to go in there. So I pop that in the side. I did a little reel recently. If you follow me on Instagram, go check it out. I did a reel on me packing my work bag for the week. Um, yeah, I thought it was just a really nice way to show you guys how I do it. Ryan helped me film that one. Thank God for Ryan. My tripod wasn't working. So I was like, Ryan, you need to come here, be really still and just like film this for me. <laughs> then my keys go down the side. This little bag I put in that side. Um, the perfume I like to just put down in a pocket down the side as well. Actually, no, I'm going to put the perfume in the little pochette. It'll probably sit better. So that goes in there. I then have my diary. This one here is a brand new one. Um, I bought it from Kmart for only $9. Look how beautiful it is. Um, and it started from June for the rest of this year and all of next year. So I've put in all the important dates in there and I'm trying to plan a holiday for Ryan and I for next year. This year is just looking, he's too busy with work and we've got a lot going on with the house with the kitchen arriving in a couple of weeks. And then once the kitchen's in, it then it's just a bit of a domino effect with what else needs to be done in the house. So this year, I don't think we're going to be going on any major holidays, um, but next year I really want to do a decent trip overseas. So we're just in the very early stages of planning that. So it's been really, really handy having this. I then also have my yeah wallet and then this is my Prada Sunnies um, sunglasses case. And when it comes to work, it can fit in my bag. So I definitely use this, put my sunglasses in there plenty of space. So my wallet goes down the side and my sunglasses case. And the other thing that I've been using in my bag every single day, this, this is a um, glass sort of tumbler cup that I recently bought. Right now it's got some cold tea in there. It's honestly so good and fits in my bag really, really well. I've got a little drink holder in the side and because generally in the mornings I have my coffee, like my keep cup with me. So um, I've got room in my bag to hold this and I push it down the side. So that's everything in my organizer like that. And then I slip it into here. And because I like to use a smaller organizer for this bag, um, I have room to fit my diary down the side. So I'll just pop this in. So. I don't know if you can see that. I've got the organizer in there and then I use my diary and I slip it down the side on the outside of the organizer. And that is just, it fits like a glove. So I have everything in there and that's what I call a little bit of a handbag reset. I can tell this video is going to be quite short, um, but it's a really nice little thing to do. It's a little bit therapeutic for me and it really does set you up for a really good week. So on a Sunday evening, if you just spend that time getting your work bag ready, getting everything organized, the next day you can pick up your bag, go to work, and I promise you, it just sets you up for a really organized week. So yeah, absolutely love doing that, and it's definitely a little ritual of mine. But yes, that is my little handbag reset. I hope you guys enjoyed this little quick video, and I hope it inspires you to start making a bit of a, um, a ritual out of it every Sunday evening if you just take that time giving everything a clean out, um, rolling up all your cords, um, putting everything in its spot. It really does set you up for a good week. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll see you in my next one. Thanks guys.